Exercise 3, Interaction Techniques, Trigonometric Functions, number 1. Now I'll just pause the video. And have a go at this one. OK, now uh, we'll, do, we'll write out the integral again. So i equals the integral of sine squared x over 2. Now clearly you'll have to use a double angle. Now the cos of 2x equals 1 minus 2 sine squared x. But we have an x on 2 in here. So we'll say that the cos of x will be equal to 1 minus 2 sine squared x on 2. Now this becomes sine squared x on 2 is equal to a half outside of 1 minus cos x. So our integral becomes 1 half outside of 1 minus cos x. Be a dx here. dx. And that gives me 1 half. That becomes x. Integral of cos is sine. So that's minus sine x plus a constant. All right, number two, evaluate the integral between pi upon 6 and 0 of cos squared 3x dx. I'm going to pause the video. All right, now here is the solution. Writing out the integral again, we have i equals pi upon 6 and 0 of cos squared 3x dx. Now we know that the, the cos of 2x equals 2 cos squared x minus 1. Therefore, the cos of 6x must equal 2 cos squared 3x minus 1. Therefore, the cos squared of 3x is equal to, this will be cos 6x plus 1. And a half out the front. So we just pop that in and we get a half outside of cos 6x plus 1 dx between pi upon 6 and 0. And now integrating that we get 1 half. Now cos goes to the positive sign. It's 1 sixth of sine 6x plus x between pi upon 6 and 0, which is, I put the pi upon 6 in there, you're going to get this, the sine of pi, which is 0, and this is going to be pi upon 6, and of course, this will be 0, which gives you the final result of pi upon 12.